Hey, Outsider fam, how are you? Look who I am with right now at Remo Homes and at their current drive home. And I'm so excited to tell you all so much about it. So I'm sure you all know the very famous and super intelligent <laughs> Bumsi. And I met Ryan. So very, very nice to meet you. And we spoke about everything, not just modular. We spoke about science and evolution and for, and and a little bit of politics, so everything, okay? But let's talk about modular because we are an outsider. So first of all, I'm blown away by the fact of how closely they understand supply chain, the importance of supply chain, the importance of being energy efficient. They are really thinking sustainability and they are applying it. So the best part is they are designing to be lean, right? And so we are talking lean and that's why you see me here. So I really have a question for you. Sure. I walked, I, I met the team. I heard about materials that you're using. You're really being conscious about it, but tell, and I understand, but I want my uh, audience to understand your goal by, by while building uh, this prototype home. And what is it that is really standing you out from what the rest of the industry is trying to do? How, how are we different? And how are we going to change our mindset where we are going with modular? Sure. I mean, there's a few things, but I feel that like we are a very mission oriented company and uh, we are married to solving the problem and not like married to our own solution as it stands right now, because solutions can change and adapt. The problem is always there are the home housing crisis, the climate crisis. So that allowed us to knock on quite a few doors of people who've done this before and failed or people doing this right now. I think that's the main differentiator. What it comes to like more concrete is we want to be the lowest cost per square foot, a man hours per square foot, and like you know, and also uh, consumption per square foot on an annual basis for uh, energy use. We want to be the best in the world for that. And uh, it and our product is net zero a resilient home, which is a little bit dis distinct from most regular homes. So we were different in like you know, uh, our metrics, we're different in our go-to market, which is going after developers, and then we're different in how we're going about, which is you know really optimizing with lean design and lean manufacturing before we scale up. Thank you, thank you so much. So would like to hear a little bit about lean, but also on the design side. And maybe you can also throw in the cool experiment that you were doing in my life. Important. Yeah, definitely, definitely. <laughs> yeah, I think uh, especially at this level of design, we're trying to design with interoperable parts. So we can have mm -hmm. the minimum variance in product and we can minimize our bomb because less less parts, less materials, less miles traveled for you know each product. And uh, when you walked in, we were doing some experimentation. We built a vacuum insulated panel. We built our own, and we built a little uh, thermal conductivity uh, chamber. So we were very, you know, validating our hypothesis on our, our level of our vacuum sealed panel, vice the uh, traditional panels that we could get a, a certified R value for. Like uh, when you walked in, we were comparing awesome. the two inch depth vacuum panel with a two inch depth uh, foam panel. Awesome, you're like a scientist to me. <laughs> I love chatting with you. And the cool part is they're not just talking about it, they're talking about circular strategies. We talked about co-location, which is a big deal, right? Short supply chains. So we talk about it a lot. And so I literally got a chance to see all of this in action, see all of this that they are really thriving for. And I cannot wait to see what their production, when they go in production and what that uh, efficient production line and what the cost per square foot would look like. But uh, we'll be back with that when they are ready. But thank you so much for tuning in.